in the old days of Guilford County, when many people died, they were unable to find rest. Trapped in purgatory, their spirits lurked around, frightening the good citizens of Guilford. Feeding on the negative fears and emotions of the living, the spirits grew stronger and stronger. As time passed, more and more undead walked the streets. That was when Eddie McMillan, a man of God, came to Greensboro. McMillan used the power of our Lord to collect all of the spirits and banished them all to the woods, now known as the Woods of Terror. The woods at that time was owned by Reverend Eddie McMillan and was tucked far away from living souls in a remote area on North Church Street. It happened one Halloween's Eve. The clown circus came to Greensboro and set up the midway in these remote woods, not knowing the history of the woods and all the lost souls who lurked there. The circus began. And so there was a reawakening of all the angry spirits. So much so that the spirits consumed the circus and took them also into purgatory. For many years, the tale of the ghost filled midway frightened everyone who heard it. Being the great, great, Grandson of Eddie McMillan, I decided to take on the challenge of controlling the undead by using the power of the Lord and old manuscripts left to me by my great-great-grandfather. And I have been successful in harnessing these spirits again. Now, every Halloween season, the circus midway spirits return to the woods of terror. They rise at sunset and march through the midway, led by the coffin dragster. These spirits prey on the brave souls that have come to the midway to experience the terror of the woods, feeding on fear and negative energy. Happy Halloween! The feeding begins! Circus spirits invite you to come and participate in a once-in-a-lifetime experience. The trail starts in the midway. As you enter the woods, you will be greeted by crawling, slithering creatures of the night. The infestation! These creatures are close and would love to be closer to you. The corn is ready for harvest in the daytime, but at night, the night stalkers are busy harvesting those lost in the corn. The night stalkers are among the corn, ready for the next bushel of souls. If you are lucky enough to escape, and are brave enough to continue, the noise of a factory awaits you. The factory is always busy, and not a place that includes workmen's cars. This is an industrial nightmare, and the night shift is permanently on duty, tired, mean, and wants a raise. Raise the dead, that is! The clowns take you where no one has gone before. The walls move, the floor moves, and your mind will be warped by the chaos. The Chaos 3D is something that will change you for the rest of the night, unless you decide to stay for the rest of your life. Once you step out of the chaos, you better watch your neck. Come to the house party at the Blood House. 
Drinks are on you. Or you are the drink. If you are warm-blooded, then you are welcome to enter. If you want to leave, a donation of blood may be required. The graveyard has been here for many years, and you can see the tombstones. Some people say that many of the graves are now empty. This is where the awakening is. Keep your eyes open. You are not safe until the sun rises. The Late Show tonight features you with some of the scariest movies ever made. At Horrorwood Cinema Grande, you don't watch the movies, you live them. The admission is free, but the cost is your life. Don't stop for candy. Those calories can kill you. North Carolina is home of the evil pirate Blackbeard. His ghost ship appeared in the woods of terror years ago. This is Blackbeard's revenge. A voodoo priestess raised the pirate Blackbeard. He has returned, and the treasure he seeks isn't gold, but souls. Miners throughout North Carolina have gold, and gold changes people. The gold mine in Woods of Terror has a history, a massacre. All of the miners were found dead, massacred by an unknown force. Maybe you will find out what happened to the miners. Maybe you will find the lost gold. You will stay lost underground. Screaming or an occasional chainsaw is normal for the slaughterhouse. If you are looking for a tow truck on a North Carolina road, hope it isn't this one. Or your car may be just another wreck in the front yard. And you may be another body buried in the back. The family always invites guests in. If you see the flashing light, then be careful. The virus is spreading. There are some helpful guides that are going to try to keep you safe, unless they are infected too. There are doctors, but they might be at lunch. Just a quick bite. Now, face your fears. Place a hood over your head and enter the world of sound, touch, and fear. This is an experience that will leave you shaking all over. When the trail ends, you will be back where it all began, in the midway. You may need some energy roots from the ground, or fire to warm your bones. Woods of Terror is waiting to take you. <laughs> <laughs>